News 4 Tucson Paul C. Kala joins us more from the Riverwalk. The San Antonio Riverwalk is alive and well right here in Texas during the NCAA tournament. Of course, if you missed it, the Arizona Wildcats ended up losing in the Sweet 16 to Houston right here in San Antonio. But it didn't stop many of the Tucsonans that made the trip from the Old Pueblo right here to San Antonio from still taking part in tourist activities like hanging out right here at the Riverwalk. And one thing's for sure, they still enjoy getting together and representing Tucson Strong right here in San Antonio. It came down in an RV all the way from Tucson. You heard Mark Acuna, director of Arizona's Department of Alumni Relations, write, win or lose, a group of diehard students still made the trip in a travel trailer led by Matt Myers. So it's parked at an Airbnb that we rented uh, about two miles uh, from where we are right now. And we're all slumbered over there. And we're really happy to just be together and be able to share these memories as seniors. Memories of a Sweet 16 loss, but a really fun road trip that fans know going in, the chances of losing are high. It's anybody's ball game in the Sweet 16, and continuing the Wildcat camaraderie is well worth it. Just to see all of our friends and neighbors and fellow Wildcats in a, in a town like San Antonio and all rooting for, our, for the home team, so much fun. Sporting that sea of Wildcat red, even with the loss, still not letting the bad basketball luck ruin their road trip. Yeah, go Cats, let's go! Gotta love the true representation of Arizona fans here in San Antonio, so far away, even with the loss. Lots of players are returning for next season and they are still expecting big things. We'll have more with the Wildcats a bit later in sports, as mentioned. Reporting from San Antonio at the historic Riverwalk, Paul Cicala, News 4, Tucson.